Ukraine. There are signs that it's becoming increasingly difficult for Russians to resist. The defense forces are working to destroy the equipment and personnel of the Russian forces, and there are signs that it's becoming increasingly difficult for invaders to resist, Deputy Minister of Defense Hanna Malia said. The main task facing us now, apart from moving forward, is, of course, weakening the enemy's ability to defend itself. And, in fact, this is being done now. Dozens of ammunition depots are destroyed every week. Hundreds of Russian soldiers are decimated per day. Their equipment is destroyed. We already see signs that it is becoming increasingly difficult for the enemy to resist. And our defenders are full of strength to move forward, Malia said. According to her, the Ukrainian troops advance gradually in the Bakhmut direction, south of Bakhmut. Fierce fighting continues in the settlements of Kurdyumivka, Klishyivka and Andriyivka, where the Russian army is using artillery and mortars. To the north of Bakhmut, Ukrainian soldiers repel the attacks of the enemy, who is trying to regain lost positions. At the same time, Russian troops try to knock the defense forces out of the dominant heights in Lyman Kupiansk direction, but have no success. Malia noted that the invaders did not give up their goal to encircle Avdiyivka. They don't risk entering the city itself because they are afraid of getting stuck there in city battles. The deputy minister noted that the defense forces advanced on the southern offensive lines, Melitopol and Berdyansk, gradually but steadily. We are moving, but we need to realize the enemy's efforts and resistance we are facing, she stressed.